My beloved child, before you go any further, know this what you're about to hear could be the breakthrough you've been waiting for. If you've ever felt broken, lost, or like nothing will ever be the same again, I need you to stay with me. Because in the next few moments I'm going to reveal something that will restore the deepest parts of your heart. You are not here by accident, and this message is for you. Don't scroll away because what you've been searching for, the healing, the peace, the restoration, it's all coming to you right now. Let me show you how I'm about to make all things new in your life. Stay with me and listen closely to the end. Now I want to tell you something that will change everything you are not broken beyond repair. I am restoring what was broken. This is my promise to you. So listen closely and allow my words to fill you with peace and joy. My child, I have watched over every part of your journey. I have seen the pain, the heartache, and the moments when you felt like pieces of your life were shattered beyond recognition. I have felt every tear that fell from your eyes, and I know the weight of the burdens you've carried. In those moments when everything seemed lost, you may have thought that nothing could ever be whole again. But I am here to tell you that what is broken is not lost. What has been damaged is not beyond repair. I am the one who makes all things new, and I am at work in your life, restoring everything that has been torn apart. I know there have been times when you have felt abandoned, like your heart was fractured in ways that could never be mended. You've looked at the pieces of your life and wondered how anything good could ever come from the brokenness. But let me remind you, my dear child, that I am the creator of all things. I am the one who shaped you, who gave you life and breath. There is nothing broken in your life that is too difficult for me to restore. I see not only the broken pieces, but I also see the beauty that will come from them once I have restored them. Trust in me, for I am working in ways you cannot yet see. Right now you may feel like you're standing in the middle of ruins, pieces of dreams, relationships and plans that you once cherished. But I want you to understand something very important I have never left you, and I never will. In fact, I am already at work, rebuilding and restoring what has been broken. Sometimes when you look at the brokenness, it's easy to feel hopeless, like nothing can be salvaged. But I want you to know that I am not just putting things back together, I am creating something even better than what was before. Where you see loss, I see opportunity for growth. Where you feel pain, I am planting seeds of healing. Where there has been brokenness, I am bringing restoration. There is a great purpose in what you have gone through. You see, my dear child, nothing is wasted in my hands. Every tear, every heartache, every moment of brokenness has not been in vain. I use all things for good, even the moments that feel the hardest. You may not understand it now, but the broken pieces of your life are being used to create something far more beautiful than you could ever imagine. The cracks in your heart are where my light shines the brightest. The moments of weakness are where my strength is made perfect. The places that feel shattered are exactly where I am building something new, something stronger, something that will stand the test of time. You see, my dear one, I am not merely interested in patching things up or gluing the pieces of your life back together in the same way they were before. No, I am creating something entirely new. I am the god of new beginnings, and what I restore is always made better than it was before. I take the broken pieces and make them into something beautiful. I take the things that have been torn apart and weave them together into a tapestry of grace and glory. In my hands, nothing is beyond redemption, and no brokenness is beyond restoration. I know you may not see it yet, but trust in me because I am at work, and what I restore will leave you in awe. I want you to think about this. My child, every season of brokenness you've endured has prepared you for the restoration I am bringing. 
Every piece of your heart that felt like it was lost forever is now being placed back in its rightful place, but not as it was before better, stronger, more beautiful. There is a time for everything under the heavens, and now is your time for healing, for renewal, for restoration. I am speaking these words over you because I need you to believe in the power of what I can do. When you place your trust in me, I will move in your life in ways that go beyond what you could ever hope or imagine. I know it's hard to trust when you can't yet see the outcome. I know that you've been hurt, and that pain makes it difficult to believe in restoration. But I am asking you to hold on to faith, even when it feels like everything around you is falling apart. I am not limited by the things of this world. My power is limitless and my love for you is greater than anything you can fathom. I will restore what was broken in ways that will astonish you, and it will be for your good. Trust in my timing, my child, because I am never late. Even when it feels like nothing is happening, I am working behind the scenes, bringing everything together for your good. I know there have been moments when you've wondered why things had to be broken in the first place. You've questioned why certain things in your life had to fall apart, why relationships had to end, why dreams had to be crushed. But I want you to know that even in the breaking, I was with you. Even when it felt like you were losing everything, I was holding on to you. And now, as I begin to restore what was broken, you will see that every piece had a purpose. You will see that the breaking was not meant to destroy you, but to prepare you for something far greater. What I am restoring in your life will bring you more joy, more peace, more fulfillment than you ever thought possible. So my dear child, hold on to hope. Don't let the brokenness define you because I am already at work, making all things new. I am restoring relationships that you thought were lost forever. I am bringing healing to places in your heart that have long been wounded. I am breathing new life into dreams that you thought had died. I am restoring what was broken, and I am making it better than it ever was before. The journey may have been painful, but the restoration will be glorious. I am the God who brings beauty from ashes, who makes a way where there seems to be no way, and who restores what was broken. Let my words fill your heart with peace and faith. Trust in my promise, for it is sure. I have never abandoned you, and I never will. The brokenness in your life is not the end of your story, it is the beginning of something new and beautiful. I am restoring what was broken, and soon you will see the fullness of my work in your life. You are loved, you are cherished, and you are not forgotten. Everything that has been broken will be made whole again, and it will be more beautiful than you ever imagined. Trust in me, for I am your God, and I am restoring what was broken. My beloved child, as you continue on this journey of restoration, I want to remind you of something important. Your pain has not been in vain. Every tear you've shed, every night you've spent in sorrow, every moment of brokenness has been seen by me. I have not turned away from your suffering. In fact, I have been closer to you than you can ever imagine, holding you, comforting you, even when you didn't realize it. Now, as I begin to bring restoration into your life, I want you to understand the depth of my love for you. I have never left you, not even for a second. There is something beautiful about the process of restoration. It's not simply about returning to what once was, it's about transforming what has been broken into something even more magnificent. When you look at the broken pieces of your life, it's easy to feel overwhelmed, to wonder how anything good could possibly come from the mess. But I want you to know that I see the bigger picture. I see how each piece, each moment of your life, fits together perfectly to create something far more glorious than you could ever imagine. The brokenness you've experienced is not a sign of failure, 
but rather a necessary part of the process of growth and transformation. It's through the cracks in your heart that my light shines through the brightest. It's in your weakness that my strength is made perfect. Where you feel you have been shattered, I am rebuilding you, stronger and more resilient than ever before. I am restoring you from the inside out, bringing healing to every part of your being, your mind, your heart, your spirit. Trust in this process, for it is guided by my loving hands. I want you to look forward with hope, my child. Even if you can't yet see the full picture, know that the work I am doing in your life is good. The restoration I am bringing will not only mend the broken places, but will also make them stronger and more beautiful. You are not defined by your past or by the things that have been broken. You are defined by my love for you, by the purpose I have placed within you, and by the restoration I am working in your life. I am making you new, and this new creation will be a testament to my power, my grace, and my mercy. I understand that it can be difficult to trust when you've experienced so much pain. I know there are parts of your heart that are hesitant, that fear being broken again. But I want you to know that you are safe in my hands. I will not let you fall. I will not let your heart remain shattered. I am the God of healing, and I am faithful to complete the good work I have started in you. My restoration is not temporary, it is eternal. What I restore, no one can break. What I heal, no one can harm. You are under my protection, and I am working all things together for your good. Now as you wait for the full manifestation of my restoration in your life, I want to encourage you to remain steadfast in your faith. Trust in my timing because I know what is best for you. There are moments when it may seem like nothing is happening, like the restoration process is taking longer than you expected. But I assure you, every moment is part of my divine plan. Sometimes the greatest miracles happen in the quietest moments. While you may not see the full restoration yet, I am working behind the scenes, putting every piece into place. Soon you will witness the beautiful masterpiece I am creating from what was once broken. Do not grow weary in your waiting, my child, for those who wait upon me will renew their strength. They will rise up on wings like eagles, they will run and not grow weary, they will walk and not faint. Your time of restoration is coming and it will come with great joy and celebration. The things that once brought you sorrow will be transformed into sources of joy. The places where you once felt loss will become places of abundance. The relationships that were broken will be restored in ways that exceed your expectations. I am the God of restoration, and what I restore I make whole and complete. There is a beauty in the waiting too, my child. For in the waiting, you learn to trust me more deeply. In the waiting, you grow in faith and patience and in hope. The waiting is not a punishment, it is a season of preparation. During this time, I am working in your heart, preparing you to receive the fullness of what I have for you. I am strengthening your spirit, building your character, and deepening your relationship with me. When the restoration comes, and it will come, you will be ready to embrace it fully, without fear or hesitation. So, my dear one, do not be discouraged by the brokenness that you see around you. I am the God who restores all things, and I am restoring you. Trust in me, for I am faithful. I will never leave you nor forsake you. My love for you is constant, unchanging, and eternal. There is nothing too broken for me to heal, no wound too deep for me to mend. I am the God of restoration, and I am making all things new in your life. You are not defined by the brokenness of your past. You are defined by my love for you, by the purpose I have placed within you, and by the restoration I am bringing into your life. You are my child, and I take great delight in you. I am with you. 
and I am working all things together for your good. Even when it feels like you are surrounded by broken pieces, know that I am with you, gathering those pieces and creating something beautiful from them. My dear child, lift your eyes to me. Do not focus on the brokenness but on the one who restores. I am your God and I am faithful. I am restoring what was broken, and I am making it better than it ever was before. Trust in me, for I am with you always. I know there are moments when you feel overwhelmed by the weight of the brokenness, when it feels like the pieces are too scattered to ever be brought together again. But I am the one who spoke the stars into existence, who formed the mountains and set the seas in their place. If I can create the universe with just a word, imagine what I can do with the broken pieces of your life. There is no limit to my power, and there is no limit to my love for you. I want you to release your worries, your fears, and your doubts into my hands. Let go of the need to fix things on your own, for I am the one who restores, I am your strength, your comfort, your ever-present help in times of trouble. When you feel like you can't go on, turn to me, for I will carry you. When you feel like everything is falling apart, trust in me, for I am holding everything together. I am restoring what was broken, and I am doing it in a way that will bring you greater joy, greater peace, and greater fulfillment than you ever thought possible. My beloved child, you are never alone. I am always with you, guiding you, protecting you, and restoring you. Trust in my promises, for they are sure. I will never leave you, and I will never forsake you. I am restoring what was broken, and soon you will see the fullness of my work in your life. You are loved, you are cherished, and you are never forgotten. I am your God and I am restoring what was broken. My precious child, as we move deeper into this journey of restoration, I want you to know something even more profound. The work I am doing in your life is not just about mending what was lost or fixing what was broken, it is about transforming your entire being into the glorious person you were always meant to be. You see, restoration is not a mere return to the past. It is a process of renewal, rebirth, and elevation. It is me taking the broken places, the shattered dreams, the deep wounds, and turning them into something far more beautiful than you ever imagined. I am restoring your heart, yes, but I am also expanding it. I am widening your capacity to love, to forgive, to hope, and to trust. Through the brokenness, you have learned compassion, through the pain you have discovered strength, and through the loss you have realized the value of what truly matters. Now as I restore what was broken, I am also restoring your vision, your ability to see the world and your life through the lens of my divine purpose. The things that once seemed insurmountable will now be stepping stones to greater things. I need you to understand this, my dear one, the process of restoration is often unseen before it becomes evident. Just as a seed grows beneath the soil long before it breaks through the surface, so too are the works of restoration I am performing in your life. Even when you don't see the changes immediately, trust that they are happening. You may not always feel the healing as it happens, but know that each day, each moment you are being renewed. Every prayer you've whispered, every time you've turned to me in faith, I have heard you, and I have been moving. There are times when you will look at the broken pieces and wonder, how can this ever be restored but, my beloved, I want you to know that the things that seem most broken are often the things that become the greatest sources of strength and beauty. When I restore something, I do not merely patch it up, I transform it. I make it new. The very places where you have felt the deepest hurt will become the areas where you experience the greatest healing. The places where you have felt abandoned will be the places where you feel my presence most profoundly. 
I am working all things for your good, even the brokenness. I want you to take a moment and think about the areas of your life that feel the most broken. Perhaps it is a relationship, a dream, or a part of your heart that feels beyond repair. Now, place those things in my hands. Let go of the need to control the outcome. Let go of the fear that nothing can change. Trust Maine to work in those areas. Trust Maine to bring healing where there has been pain, to bring joy where there has been sorrow, to bring peace where there has been chaos. I am not only capable of restoring what was broken, I am eager to do so. I desire to bring you into a place of abundance, a place of peace, a place of complete and total restoration. Sometimes, my dear child, restoration begins in ways that you don't expect. It may not always look like what you thought it would. The path to restoration may take you in directions you never anticipated, but trust that I am guiding you each step of the way. What seems like a detour is often the very road that leads to the greatest breakthroughs. What feels like a delay is often my divine timing, preparing you for something greater than you could have imagined. I know the plans I have for you, and they are good. They are plans to prosper you, to give you hope and a future. You are not alone in this journey, my child. I am with you every step of the way, and I am placing people in your life who will walk alongside you. Sometimes restoration comes through the love and support of those around you, through the kindness of a friend, through the encouragement of someone who believes in you. Don't be afraid to lean on others, to share your heart, and to accept the help I am sending your way. You were never meant to walk this path alone, and I have placed others in your life to be a source of strength and encouragement for you. Allow yourself to be open to the ways I am working through them. As I restore was broken, I want to remind you that this is also a time for you to release the things that no longer serve you. There are parts of your past, parts of your pain, that you have held onto for too long. You've clung to the brokenness because it has become familiar, but now is the time to let go. Release the hurts, the grudges, the regrets. Place them in my hands and trust that I will bring healing and closure to those areas. You do not need to carry the weight of the past any longer. I am making all things new, and that includes releasing you from the chains of what has been holding you back. As I restore what was broken, I am also calling you into a new season of your life. A season of renewal, of joy, of abundance. The things that have been taken from you will be restored in greater measure. The dreams that have felt out of reach will begin to take shape again, but this time they will be aligned with my perfect will for your life. You will begin to see doors open that you never thought possible. Opportunities will come your way that you didn't even know existed. This is the season of restoration, my child, and it is also a season of expansion. I am enlarging your territory, increasing your influence, and filling your life with blessings beyond what you can imagine. You are a part of my plan, my dear one, and that plan is good. It has always been good, even in the moments when you couldn't see it. Every step you've taken, every decision you've made, every experience you've had has been a part of the process of shaping you into who you are today. And now, as I restore what was broken, you will begin to see the fullness of that plan unfold. The pieces of the puzzle that once seemed scattered and confusing will come together in perfect harmony. The things that once felt like detours will reveal themselves as necessary steps along the journey. You will begin to understand the why behind the brokenness, and you will see how it all fits into the greater picture of your life. Restoration is not just about healing what was broken, it is about stepping into the fullness of who you are meant to be. You are my child and I have placed greatness within you. 
You have a purpose, a calling, a destiny that is uniquely yours. The brokenness was never meant to destroy you, it was meant to prepare you. And now, as I restore what was broken, you will step into that purpose with confidence, knowing that you are equipped for everything I have called you to do. You are stronger than you realize, braver than you know, and more loved than you can imagine. My beloved, the restoration I am bringing into your life is not just for you, it is also for those around you. As I heal and restore you, you will become a beacon of hope and light to others who are walking through their own seasons of brokenness. Your story will be a testimony to my goodness, my faithfulness, and my power to restore. You will be a source of encouragement, of strength, and of love to those who need it most. The restoration I am working in your life is not just about your healing, it is about the healing of others through you. You are a vessel of my love, my grace, and my restoration. So, my child, continue to trust in me. Continue to walk in faith, knowing that I am restoring what was broken. The process may take time, but I am with you every step of the way. You are never alone, and you are never without hope. My love for you is unending, and my plans for you are good. Trust in the restoration I am bringing, for it will exceed your wildest expectations. What was broken will be made new, and what was lost will be restored. You are loved, my child. You are cherished. You are not forgotten, and you are never beyond repair. I am the God who restores, and I am making all things new in your life. Trust in me, for I am faithful. I am restoring what was broken, and the best is yet to come. My precious child, as I continue to speak this truth into your heart, I want you to take a deep breath and feel the peace that comes from knowing that I, your God, am always working on your behalf. Even in the darkest moments, when the brokenness seems overwhelming, know that I am present. I am not just an observer of your pain, I am intimately involved in your healing, in your restoration, and in your growth. There is no part of your life that escapes my attention. Every detail, every moment of suffering, every cry from your heart, I have seen it all. And I have been working behind the scenes, orchestrating the perfect time for your restoration. You see, my dear child, the brokenness you have experienced is not the end of your story, it is part of a greater story of redemption and renewal. Sometimes it's in the most broken places that I do my greatest work. Think of a seed that must be buried in the dark, hidden in the soil, before it can sprout and grow into something beautiful. In the same way, your heart has gone through times of darkness, but that is not the final chapter. I am bringing you into a season of growth, of renewal, of beauty that will far surpass anything you have known before. It is easy to feel lost when things fall apart. It's easy to feel like the pieces of your life will never fit together again, like the damage is too great to be repaired. But I want you to know, my beloved, that I am not just putting the pieces back together, I am creating something entirely new. Where there has been brokenness, I am bringing wholeness. Where there has been pain, I am bringing healing. Where there has been loss, I am bringing restoration beyond what you can imagine. I know you may have doubts. I know there are moments when you question whether things will truly be restored. It's okay to feel that way your doubts do not push me away. But I ask that you place those doubts in my hands. I ask that you give me your fears, your uncertainties, and your worries, and let me replace them with faith. Faith that I am who I say I am. Faith that I am the God who makes all things new. Faith that I can take even the most broken parts of your life and turn them into something beautiful. You may wonder why the brokenness had to happen in the first place. You may question why I allowed certain things to be taken from you, certain dreams to be shattered, certain relationships to fall apart. But I want you to know, my child, 
that I never allow anything without purpose. Even in the midst of the pain there is a plan. Even in the moments when it feels like everything is falling apart, I am still holding everything together. I am not the author of chaos, I am the god of peace. And though you may not understand it now, one day you will look back and see how every piece of your story fits together perfectly in my plan. The brokenness you have experienced has not been for nothing. It has shaped you, refined you, and brought you closer to me. It has prepared you for the restoration that is coming. And let me tell you this, my dear child, the restoration I am bringing is not just about returning to what once was. It is about stepping into something new, something better, something more aligned with my purpose for your life. The old has passed away, and behold, I am doing a new thing. Can you not perceive it? Even now I am making a way in the wilderness and streams in the wasteland. The places in your life that once felt dry and desolate will be filled with my living water. The areas where you felt abandoned will become places of abundant life. As I restore what was broken, I want to remind you of the strength that I have placed within you. You are stronger than you think, my child. The brokenness did not break you, it shaped you into someone even more resilient, someone who has learned to trust in me more deeply. There is a strength in you that comes from me, a strength that will carry you through the process of restoration. When you feel weary, when you feel like you can't go on, turn to me. I will be your strength. I will be your refuge. I will be the one who lifts you up when you feel like you are falling. You do not have to do this on your own, I am with you, and I will never leave you. There is a time for everything, my child, and now is the time for restoration. Now is the time for healing. Now is the time for renewal. You have been through the fire, but you have come out refined, stronger and ready for the new season I am bringing you into. The old things that have weighed you down, the burdens that you have carried for so long, they are being lifted. I am taking them from you one by one and replacing them with my peace, my joy and my love. I want you to know that restoration is not just about the things you can see. Yes, I am restoring relationships, dreams and opportunities, but I am also restoring the things you cannot see, your heart, your spirit, your joy. The restoration I am bringing is holistic. It touches every part of your life from the inside out. Where there has been weariness, I am bringing rest. Where there has been confusion, I am bringing clarity. Where there has been sorrow, I am bringing joy. And where there has been brokenness, I am bringing healing. I know the desires of your heart, my child. I know the things you have longed for the things you have prayed for in the quiet moments when no one else was watching. I have heard every prayer, seen every tear, and I am responding. My timing is perfect, and the restoration I am bringing will exceed anything you could have hoped for. But I ask that you trust me, even in the waiting. Trust that I am working all things together for your good, even when you cannot see it. The waiting can be difficult, I know, but in the waiting I am doing a deep work in you. I am preparing you to receive the fullness of what I have for you. Sometimes the greatest growth happens in the seasons when it feels like nothing is happening at all. But trust that I am at work, and soon you will see the fruit of that work. Soon you will look around and see the evidence of my restoration in every area of your life. There is beauty in the waiting, my child, for it is in the waiting that you learn to trust me more deeply. It is in the waiting that you learn to surrender fully to my will, knowing that my plans for you are good. And it is in the waiting that you are being prepared for the greater things I have in store for you. So hold on to hope, my beloved. The restoration is coming. The healing is coming. The renewal is coming. I am restoring what was broken, and I am making it better than it ever was before. 
You are not forgotten. You are not beyond repair. You are my precious child, and I am working all things together for your good. Remember this always, you are loved, you are cherished, you are mine, and I am restoring what was broken. Stay close to me, my child, for I am your eternal support, your constant companion, your loving father. I am restoring what was broken, and soon you will see the fullness of my work in your life. The best is yet to come, and I am leading you into it with my hand of grace, love, and unshakable promise. Trust in me, for I am faithful. You are never alone, my beloved. I am restoring what was broken, and I am making all things new. The future is bright, and I am with you, guiding you every step of the way. You are my masterpiece, and I am completing the good work I began in you. All that has been broken will be restored in my perfect time and in my perfect way.